Hi everybody, Brian Perkins, Mercedes-Benz of Arrowhead here in Peoria, Arizona. Look what we have here today. The 2023 Metris passenger van in Hyacinth Red with a black interior. Folks, this is going to be the last year of this vehicle. What's coming in the future most likely is going to be hybrid or electric. It's pretty much going to look the same on the exterior. Might be some differences on the interior, but that's coming probably 25. But we have this beautiful vehicle here. Uh, it's fully loaded. Uh, you notice in the front here we have the chrome front grille, which is an option. The front bumpers are the same color as the body, another option. We have the upgraded fog lights, another option. Uh, roof rack is an option. Everything about this vehicle I'm gonna show you briefly are options on the vehicle, which makes it very unique. Uh, it's just, it's beautiful, the flow of the vehicle from front to rear. I have one of these that I drive, my wife and I, and we've had two, and uh, let me tell you, it's an eight passenger. It's just ease of entry and exit to get in and out. My wife's a school teacher, so if we have some kids in the van, just ease and entry for people to get in and out. Also, when family comes into town. Uh, you're gonna get probably roughly about 23 miles per gallon, about 70, 75 miles an hour if you're doing that 65. I know, because I drive it. My wife does, we're getting around 25 miles per gallon. You have an 18 and a half fuel gallon tank you change the oil once a year or up to 15,000 miles. This vehicle in is, is in its own category, which makes it very unique and special. That's why I like it so much. You know, you're not gonna see these on the road everywhere like you would see the other manufacturers. That's what, why I like it, it's special. Okay, there was a couple of things I wanted to show you before we transition into the interior of the vehicle. The engine. Uh, this is a four-cylinder, direct-injected gas engine, 208 horsepower, 258 pound-feet of torque at 1,250 RPM. So as soon as you press on the accelerator, it's going to go. Also, when I had our two vans, Metro's passenger vans, they had a seven-speed transition transmission. Now we have a nine-speed. It's so fluid and seamless. I mean, it's, it's just... What they've done every year, you know, this is my 10th year here at Mercedes-Benz, and it seems like every year they're doing something just to make it that much special, that much better than the year before. So once again, you change your oil once a year up to 15,000 miles, 208 horsepower, 258 pound-feet of torque. It's rear-wheel drive. Uh, you can tow up to 5,000 pounds. And let's go inside and check it out. Okay, you may notice that we're inside our filming booth. And I want to tell you this because this fits in a standard size garage. No problems. With plenty of room on the, ex on the rear to actually open up the, the doors on the rear. Uh, also, multi-spoke wheels, aluminum alloy, really nice. Let's open up the electric sliding doors on both sides of the vehicle. All right. So, we have, eight, we have two rows of seating in the rear three and three. The seats do come forward on the vehicle. So if you want to have rear access for the rear passenger, all right. Also, in the, you'll notice when we get inside, you have AC vents up above each seating area. So we have here on both sides and then here on the rear on both sides. So there's constant AC coming in because we know it's hot as heck here in Arizona and it has the high output AC which is just, there's no problem getting as cool, exceptionally cool in the summertime. Uh, the seats do remove, and that is a plus because you can fit, take the seats out, and this can be converted into a cargo van, which is, a, so it's dual purpose, passenger, cargo. Uh, it has, you can fit four by eight sheet of plywood, four feet by eight. Um, 
You have cargo doors in the rear that come out to the side, all the way to the sides of the body. It's exceptionally quiet. Uh, it rides exceptionally well. Like I said, you have your roof rack, exceptional air, uh, area, cargo volume also, and we're going to transition to the back and show you the rear doors. Okay, there's something that's really important that, that you need to know about this van. You know, you have 55, 55 inches, you know, across and width, height also, but if you get these large SUVs and you have a third row, when you look in the rear, you only have about this much cargo capacity. When you look at this, look at this volume you have to get with seating eight people comfortably. So this is very important. Uh, we have your trailer hitch here also with the plug that's all set up. And like I said, easy ingress, egress of if you could, if you could turn this into a cargo van. So we're going to transition to the front, show you the dash, and I appreciate it. Okay, we're inside of the 2023 Metris uh, passenger van. A couple of things on the dash here. The steering wheel, you have all your controls, fingertip controls for your thumbs. On the right side, it'll handle your infotainment area here with the seven inch screen. On the left side, it'll handle your screen here in front of you. Of course, the vehicle's gonna have your attention assist, blind spot assist, lane keeping assist, all the safety features that we're used to. It has a backup camera with 180 degree view, which is impressive when you're backing up. When you turn the steering wheel and you're trying to back into a parking lot, it has the lines that'll turn with the direction of the steering wheel. So you make sure you're guiding into a parking area. Um, like the touch screen also will have navigation. You'll have satellite radio. You'll have uh, Apple CarPlay, Android Auto. You have your controls for your rear AC, so you can sync whatever the temperature is up front to the rear, or if you want it separate, you can have se separate temperature controls for the front and separate temperature controls for the rear. Cup holders everywhere. Uh, there's two in the front. Also, you know, some, some vehicles still come with, it, with an ashtray. You know, people do smoke. Uh, two USBs connections. Uh, storage on the front, LED lighting on the interior of the van, storage compartments at the bottom. Uh, this van is for a family and also for a working family that might need a cargo van. And I appreciate you giving us the time. Here at Mercedes-Benz of Arrowhead, I'm Brian Perkins, and you have a great day.